Hi, I'm here to tell you about the Ericsson Service Delivery Platform, or SDP, that enables the introduction and adaptation of new converged multimedia services. Thanks to a smooth and very fast TTM and simplified system integration, operators can take advantage of market trends and situations to provide the services their users demand. In short, the SDP has two primary functions, manage and sell. To better understand this, imagine the SDP as a department store filled with all kinds of specialty shops. Each shop has its own suppliers and customers. The manager of the store, the operator, is always on the watch for new trends in what customers are looking for, what is being offered and where he can make money. He can use the department store to package network capabilities and services into offerings that he bundles with attractive discounts and campaigns. In order to maintain order and ensure that customers and suppliers find their way to each shop quickly and efficiently, there are flexible business support systems, operations support systems and customer relationship management systems. The SDP helps lower administrative and technical hurdles standing between users and services. This in turn leads to increased service uptake, usage, customer satisfaction and retention. SDPs make it easier for service and content providers to participate in the service exchange ecosystem and to promote, sell, monitor and safely receive payment via operator channels. It's a key tool for the operator to enable and streamline service offerings with an emphasis on management and sales. Typically, cost savings between 20 and 40 percent can be achieved by delivering cost efficiency, control and flexibility in the SDP, making this one of the most important investments an operator can make in the future of his business. SDP allows operators the tools they need to manage and sell their services in a more efficient, timely and profitable way.